Hello friends, welcome back to my gaming channel, New York. So let's continue on our gameplay walkthrough of Life is Strange 2. So, we are out, Sean is out searching for his brother Daniel. He came to a different country or a different place, I don't know, it's called Nevada. Uh, or he is going to whatever. Mm, we were going in a car, then um, the car ran out of fuel, and before that, some people beat us, beat Son badly because they are racist, basically. I think Sean is black and they are white. Okay. Uh, it's reversed. Still a few hours away from Haven Point. Almost there. One second. Uh, yeah, it's recording properly. Okay, I can't walk like properly. Sean is tired, and there isn't anything. Oh, shit! I need a break. Deserts all around. Might be some shade at the next billboard. I see the billboard there. What about this? Anything to do here? I guess not. Stop. Can't run for miles in this heat. Oh. Okay, we can't run even now. Okay, now we can. It's like a long desert. There's a desert, some shade up. Yes. Shade. Oh, man. My feet are killing me. Feels like hiking in hell. Let's drop Never our... do a desert before. Huh. It's so... Empty and quiet. I did the drawing first because, like uh, that time with uh, when we first met Cat City, I don't want to like lose that opportunity. That time I lost that opportunity to draw. <sighs> okay, just draw now. Don't think about anything else. What is this? Got a good picture of it. I'm ready to draw now. This place is so empty. <laughs> At least I won't mess up perspective for once. Okay. <sighs> I guess that's an okay start. But I can keep going. <sighs> okay. Just draw now. Don't think about anything else. I need to train my visual memory even harder now. Got a good picture of it. I'm ready to draw now. Guess I could spice things up a bit. <laughs> Make the whole thing funnier. I could try adding details. Focus a bit more. Okay. Just draw now. Don't think about anything else. My eye always starts hurting when I focus for too long. Okay, now let's drink water. <sighs> Shit. My throat feels like sand. Two pair casino poker blackjack spaghetti twenty two miles ahead. 
I don't see anything else around, so let's get up. Can I climb this? Daniel I better be okay. Feels like I haven't seen him in years. Of course I miss everything about him. Even his whining. Yeah, you can't wait to get out on your own. Can I now check you out? Are. And it sucks. Hello, fellow traveler. Daniel might dig this. Another souvenir, I guess. Yeah. Whoa! Oh, shit. Holy shit. Better stick to the road. Yeah. You're right. Dead animal. Shit. This place is freaking me out. Jeez, never been so far south. Everything's so harsh out here. Oh, shit, there's a truck coming. Whoa, is he honking at me? He's stopping. Uh, okay. Okay, uh, be cool. Just. See what he wants. Let's go past for the truck moves away. Truckers can't be cops. Right? Maybe. Hey, need a lift? It's too damn hot to be walking. Yeah, I need a lift. I do need a lift. Yeah, thanks. Hold up. Hope he's a good guy. Jeez, what the hell happened to you? I ran into a couple of assholes who beat me up for no reason. Uh, I see. Happens a lot around here. Hey, Anton, you there? Everything all right? Yeah, what's up? GPS tells me you parked in the middle of nowhere. Just wanted to know what happened. I, uh... I had to make a shit stop. Over. <laughs> Too much information, but... 10-4. <laughs> you mean number two. <laughs> you owe me a beer for that. Over and out. Don't freak out. I... I wouldn't have picked you up. If I cared about that hitchhiking law. Okay. Cool. So, you hungry or what? You look hungry. 
Thank you, of you. <sighs> I am. Thank you. As you heard, my name's Anton. Mm. It is good, huh? My wife packs the best sandwiches. <laughs> Messy. Best sandwich ever. Seriously. Thanks, sir. Anton. Anton. Right. What's your destination? Hmm. Haven Point. You've heard of it? Oh, yeah. Straight ahead, about an hour. One hour in this trap. So imagine how long would he have to walk. Take a nap if you want. You don't have to stay awake to be nice. Hey, don't worry, kid. I'm not a fucking weirdo. Just a boring trucker. He seems nice. Last stop, Haven Point. Thank you so much. You just be careful out here. These people are kind of weird. Really? Okay. 10-4, good buddy. Okay, let's check this billboard. For sure. Claire wouldn't approve gambling. Life is a gamble, bet on the Lord. For sure. Pastora, Claire wouldn't approve gambling. Pastor Elizabeth Fisher, Universal Uprising Church. He is risen. Happy Easter. Wow. Forgot about Easter. I completely lost track of time. Can't leave. Gotta find Daniel. Parking a lot, lot of cars for a place in the middle of nowhere. Mailbox. Hope those people are caring Christians. Like our grandparents. But he said these people are queer. Can't leave. Okay, Gotta have, find Daniel. Let's check this side. Now to go inside the fence. You okay now? Is it gone? I I think. Good. Scoot back inside now. Okay, Dad. Uh, hello there. Is everything all right? Yeah, yeah. Uh, don't worry. You here for the service? Uh, 
Uh, not really. Looking for someone. Don't be shy. Everybody's welcome here. No matter who you are or where you're from. In his eyes, we are all equal. Plus, we have a pretty nice spread after the service. Stay as long as you want. Okay. Um, thanks. <laughs> Don't thank me. I'm just a vessel for our reverend. Thank her. <laughs> Looks like you're here to see our new miracle, right? What miracle? Uh, what miracle? <laughs> you haven't heard of him? Then I won't spoil it for you. He'll be here any minute now. Just come inside and see for yourself. Okay. Praise the Lord. Miracle. That poor little girl. Her cough sounds real bad. I hope that doesn't happen. Her father was nice. To do with Daniel. Maybe people won't judge me here. Sign. Called and chosen. Yeah. Very humble. When I'm telling you the part is like um, Daniel has superpowers. Okay. People can call you a miracle, right? Where are you, Daniel? And um, Jacob wanted to use him for some kind of bad stuff. Hmm. Must be more kids here. Huh. Wonder if Daniel made friends. So maybe Daniel is using his powers for something like that. I can't see anything. Guess it's time to go to church. It's so weird to picture Daniel out here. Enter the church here, yeah. but first I would like to check everything out. I don't want to miss out on anything. Practice zone. Weird. Looks like our old training range. Yeah, might be Daniel's practice place. Nevada is like a giant slot machine. Maybe I can ask a bit more about this place. Okay, nobody's answering. Everybody is at the church, most probably. Feels... out of time. Quiet. I won't enter through the back door. I wonder how many people come and go through this place. Window. Smells like bacon and bread in there. Oh, shit, I'm starving. So you got to eat some sandwich from that guy. I wonder what kind of community this is. Did Jacob really live here all his life? Yeah. Let's get into the church. I can't see anything. Guess it's time to go to church. Yep. Time. Just let's see. Okay. License plate. Wow. Must be a pretty good church to drive all this way. Sticker. Not much different than my hipster stickers. People tend to showcase what they love. Let go, let go.
Oh, feel that cold air. Oh, thank God for AC. We are in trouble. Faith. We hear that word a lot. But faith is not just a word, my brothers and sisters. Oh, no. What is faith? Remember Luke 18, 27. What is impossible for man is possible for God. Amen. With that righteous faith comes the salvation of your souls. Can you cross that invisible bridge to salvation? Yes. Do you want your soul to be saved, brothers and sisters? Yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. You are not like all these sinners out there. So I never asked the Lord for a sign. Then he gave me one. He spoke to me and told me that I was doing right. And to reward our great faith, the Lord sent me the ultimate gift, an angel. A child graced with the power of God. That's Daniel. The miracle we have all been praying for, waiting for. Can I get a hallelujah? hallelujah. Do you have faith in his power? Do you have faith in me? Then please welcome our newest member. And our latest miracle, the angel Daniel. Sam, I am certainly very happy. He looks different. Here is Daniel. Oh, praise be the Daniel. prophet who was thrown to the lions by false prophets. But God saved Daniel so he could do his work. Hallelujah. Yes, Daniel was brought to me to deliver us, to guide us from the wilderness to our destiny. Now Daniel will reveal the true power of the Lord. Question is, will Daniel even want to go back? With your own eyes. Now we have a voice, a messenger. Our flock keeps growing. I see more and more new faces. But this is only the beginning. You must spread the word. Oh, yes. Bear witness to this miracle. Thank you so much for coming. And God bless all of you. Amen. As our reverend said, we do appreciate your kind donations. This helps us keep our church and to spread the word of God. Oh yeah, 
There's only a few tickets left for our picnic raffle next Sunday. Don't miss the child and another miracle. Any questions, please talk to me outside. Bless you for coming today. <laughs> Oh, uh, hi. I saw you out in that parking lot earlier. <sighs> yep, that was me. I like to be here too. We can see the whole room, and it's where a reverend mother teaches us classes. <coughs> Whoa. You okay? Need some water? Uh, and no, sorry. I'm just kind of sick. Oh, that sucks. Uh, that's too bad. Hey, what happened to your eye? Well, that's a long story. That's okay. My name is Sarah Lee. What's yours? Aw, oh, you must be Jacob's sister. Did you get that letter from Jacob back when he was in California? Yes. <coughs> How did you know he was in California? I was with him. Uh, that's how we met. You are Daniel's brother? Really? He's always talking about you. Hey, uh, not too loud. Yes, I'm Daniel's brother, but I need some help. The Reverend Mother says we always have to help our neighbor. What do you need? What is this What place? is this place? This is our home. <coughs> our church and community. The Reverend Mother says we were all chosen by God. Who's your reverend? Who is this reverend? You don't know her? That's her mother, Lisbeth. She was blessed by the hand of God when she was my age. <laughs> she can't ever sin. The Lord guides her. What is Daniel what is doing here? Daniel doing here? He's our miracle. And the Lord brought him right to our reverend mother. I like him. He's really kind and funny. We play together all the time. So, can you take me to Daniel? Oh, yes. He's gonna be so happy when he sees you. He missed you so much for his birthday. It will be like a late surprise. I couldn't get to explore the church. Daniel, you're the living proof of their faith, and mine. I know you understand. I guess, I mean, Sean? Oh my. Sean! You came back! I knew it! You've grown up, and I know. Do I look older? What? What happened to your eye? Don't worry. It's okay. That happened at the farm? Because of me? I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. Not your fault. Forget it. It wasn't your fault. I should have. It's okay. Does it hurt? No. <laughs> Not as much as your haircut. Shut up. It's different. I kind of like it. Sean, I didn't want to leave you there. Nothing I could do. I was so scared. I even thought you were dead. And- It's okay. We're together now. Yes. So, are you gonna stay with us now? Huh? I... We still need to go to Puerto Lobos. But- we don't need to. We have a new home now. Look. One step at a time, Daniel. Give Sean a chance to process this. I'm sure this is all so 
overwhelming. By the way, my name is Lisbeth Fisher. We all prayed for your safe return. Sean, you must be a believer now in our Lord, too. Mm, kinda. Daniel told me you had faith. That's how you got here. But first, I need Sarah Lee and Daniel to grab the medicine kit. We have to take care of our new guest. This is a place of healing. Aww. Let's do it later. I want to talk to him now. Daniel? Now. Okay, Reverend Mother. Let's go, Daniel. Whoa, whoa. Hold on. Well, Sean, it's a pleasure to meet you. This is a real blessing today. You were away from Daniel for quite a while. I was in a coma. Of course. <laughs> I wasn't judging you. So what is your plan, Sean? This is a blessed family. And it would be good for Daniel to have you by his side. You should know that the Lord has big plans for him. Uh, I think I shouldn't say I want to go to Mexico right now. I will say I will stay here for a while. Maybe I could stay here for a while. You know... I am impressed by your drive and devotion. But small is the gate and narrow the way. I've heard everything about your journey, Sean. And I cannot let a sinner like you into my community. Not until you make penance. What? Are you serious? I'm sorry my son. I'm not your son. And Daniel isn't gonna be your golden cow. Daniel, come on. Why don't we ask him what he wants to do? Do not touch me. What the fuck? What did you do? Nothing. Enough. You spilled blood in the Lord's home. Sean, what happened? Your brother came in here, impure and acting like a criminal. But he can be saved, Daniel. I'm sorry, Sean. She's right. I will pray for you. Then, when you're ready, we can. She's trying to manipulate you. Yeah. Let me lead you to the one true light that never goes out. I want to be your friend. You're crazy. Let's get out of here, Daniel. I want to stay. Just go. There's your answer, Sean. We're together again. So we can go, right? Come on. Get off me, dude. What? Daniel! <coughs> let me go, asshole! <coughs> Daniel! They're not your family! Stop it. You just need to have faith. We'll be waiting. Daniel! It's okay, Sean. Sean. Daniel! There you go. Satisfied? Now don't you ever come back! Obviously, I'll get up. Come on, kid. Don't make me do this. You're not gonna win. Is it somehow they're forcing Daniel. Daniel? Daniel! You're pissing me off. This is private property. I have a legal right to stop any intruders like you. I just want my brother. But he doesn't want you. He was brought here, and this is where he's staying. Next time, I will not hesitate to use this. Now get out of here. Daniel, hey! Daniel! Sean? Karen? You won't get him back like this. 
Let's go. Holy shit. That's their model. from uh, Jacob. He said you were missing and that Daniel needed help. I believed him. Hmm. So you finally decided to check on him. You know, Sean, sooner or later, we're gonna have to talk. Where are we even going? I already have a hotel room. You're gonna need to rest and clean that dressing. I'm not, I'm not sure, but I feel like uh, they are forcing him somehow. And the little girl, Jacob's sister, is somehow related in that. I don't know. I have a feeling. I mean, I'm not telling she is guilty, but she's innocent. But they are using her somehow. I don't know. Man, didn't clean the pain away, but that felt good. At least he got his mom. Damn, you look bad. Gotta change that dressing soon. Karen's Karen son. seems to be on the move quite often. Maybe finally she will settle down with Daniel and Sean. Wonder how long Karen has been here. Did she see one of Daniel's Miracles? Judge Flyer. So Karen did check it out. Wonder if she saw Daniel in action. Sunday, fun day. Come join Reverend Fisher and new discipline Daniel for a private picnic. All you can eat barbecue. Limited seats, $20 donation. Noon 3 p.m. May 14, 2017. Kitchen. Kinda pretty. Wonder if she made it. Karen's bag. I know I shouldn't peek, but. Oh shit. Whatever. Condoms. Glad to know she learned the lesson. Dinner bills. Dinner. Karen did her own road trip to get here. Red Mahoney, Boulder City, Nevada. 
Proveos Rachoros Red Style $4.5 Apple Pie $2.5 Red Ricori Coffee $1.95 Total $8.95 Tip not included Road Cafe Kingman Arizona Arizona Grilled Cheese $3 Cut price $2.25, NY cheesecake $2, diet soda $1.5. Turning forward to look back, making the same choice twice, twice. My solitude days and dreamy nights just to find myself looking forward to turn back here. Karen did her own road trip to get here. Notebook. Damn. Karen does like to capture the world around her. Racing closer every mile, my heart goes racing sore. I remember, know the feeling. There's no fighting back the beating, tearing apart my core. Early morning blues, coffee, red eye truckles and sad families. Bad eggs, not the waitress's fault. She is a quick hurried one. Probably ending a long night shift. Tags. Says Clementine, 22 ish redhead dyed routine. Eyebrows and skin tone don't lie. Iris descent, owner's daughter, maybe. Mahoney's uh, vague, polite mind, busy mind, mildly clumsy, looks distracted, anxious. Young cook called her Clemmy, brother, boyfriend, boyfriend. Apologizes when the orders are late and she is the one getting roasted. Do mom and dad know you are dating on the job, Clemmy? Mixing up work and love seldom makes a good match. That's the brand new baby bump. And that's a brand new baby bump under the stained apron. It's 2017 and young folks are still busy making babies. I guess nothing really changes. Okay. Their mother is kind of different. So Karen did check it out. Wonder if she saw Daniel in action. Roadmap. This country is just way too big. Okay. Bible. I really should finish reading this someday. Holy Bible. Drive. Empty. Okay. Casino token. <sighs> Sorry. I still have no game. One dollar. And the house always wins. That will be a souvenir, yeah. Mobile phone. Karen's always into low tech. I even think it's the one she had back then. Backpack. This thing is killing my back. I got bruises on my bruises. Jacket seems pretty useless in the heat, but I hear nights are rough out here. These are those old letters which you got power beer. When that this motherfucker grabbed Daniel's snap stuff, I just snapped. Daniel's inventory journal. 89. Had to knock Joey so I could sneak out of the hospital. He's a true ally. I can never thank him enough for agreeing me to help me as agreeing to help me as him. Only hope he won't be in trouble because of me. Bumped into Finn on my way down the scaffolding, it messed me up. Brought back too many memories, but gotta focus on what's more important. Rich Nevada, find Daniel. So hard, so so hard to drive. Fucking miracle, I haven't been in a wreck yet. Gonna pull over soon so I can rest. Driving in the dark with one eye is the absolute worst. Would feel a lot safer walking on the edge of the cliff on a moonless night. Racist dickhead bit me the shit out of me. 
<laughs> because I wouldn't let them humiliate me. My body, whole body hurts, stomach, lungs, but I don't care. My only priority is to find Daniel. No more gas, gotta walk, end of the road. Yes, the scenery. May 11, 2017, got picked up by a trucker not far away from Happy Point. I was nervous, but the guy was really sweet. Even hooked me up with a sandwich, really needed the boots. Okay, Daniel had been brainwashed by a call. He wants to stay with them and I fucked up with this reverend. I just fell right into a trap. I am too serious. She planned this up. When he, she knew that Daniel would push, uh, Sean would push him. Just, he pushed him up lightly and she herself fell on there and hurt herself so that she could gain sympathy. Also, Karen, what the fuck is she doing here? How did she find us? Don't want anything from her, nada. So I do You've come a long, long way, buddy. Tablet. Huh. This isn't her tablet. Struggles with too many apps, open apps, but should be okay for basic browsing. Uh, joke at password is one one two seven zero. It hope you find your son. Yay, technology. She came prepared. Welcome to your new life at the Universal Uprising Church, Heaven Point. Therefore, go and make disciplines of all nations, baptizing them in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, and teaching them to obey everything I have commanded you. And surely I am with you always to the very end of the age. Matthew 28, 1920 Mission Accept the Lord, spread the word of Jesus, keep faith with the community. To seek and save the lost, Luke 19.10 Message from the Reverend Mother Elizabeth, Elizabeth Fisher As pastor of our holy church, I have devoted my life and love to the teachings of the gospel and our Lord. I was blessed since childhood to be given this calling and it is my privilege to spread the word and preside over the loving, righteous community of Heaven Point. I look forward to meeting, meeting each and every one who seeks out humble view. Together, we will begin the journey to a new life guided by the Spirit of the Lord and Savior. Rest to all. The Heaven Point community, Heaven Point, Nevada, is a living oasis where individuals and families can live out, live out their faith in a community dedicated to the teachings of Christ. All who share our faith are welcome to join us, build the bridge to the Lord and His eternal estate. Hospitality, beloved, it is a faithful thing you do in all your efforts of this for this brother, strangers as they are. 3 John 1 5. Gratitude, this is the day that the Lord has made. Let us rejoice and be glad in it. Blossom 11824. Forgiveness, get rid of all bitterness, rage, and anger, brawling and slander, along with every form of malice. Be kind and compassionate to one another, forgiving each other, just as in God forgave you. Ephesians 4.31 Reverend Mother doesn't look too humble. A Slice of Heaven Point by Robert Neen, one of the greatest mysteries of Nevada, is how it balances the Holy Spirit and Holy Dollar. Few tourists travel from around the world to seek religion here, but in the tight-knit Christmas community, Christian community of Heaven Point, Nevada, a charismatic pastor, has inspired a devout following. As she told me in all interview at her peaceful church here office, Reverend Lisa, Elizabeth Fisher has spent her whole life as a humble disciple of the Lord, feeling the call to share his love and glory in this dark age. I had a powerful experience as a child that put me on the righteous path. He smiles gently and touches my hand, but this is not about me or my story as anybody in the wonderful church can tell. 
and tell me they did. The member of the Universal Uprising Church speak with hush awe of the pastor and how she inspires them. Reverend Fisher just wants to share her blessing with us, says Story Johnson, 34, a recent addition to the congregation. I was pretty cynical before I went to one of the revivals. You could feel the electricity when she spoke. People were crying, including me. Looks like a roach motel. But nobody will find me there. Profile map, cheap model, heaven point, and bedrooms, housekeeping, restaurant, gym, group, review, forum. Sand Snake Motel, 1181 Brand Highway, Blue Rock, Nevada. Rating 2 star. One night, beds are super uncomfortable, but it's cheap. Must be nice pool, but dusty as well. At least at the nice roadside motel, pool stuff. Nothing else in there, right? She came prepared. Karen Snow. Be right back. <sighs> we'll find out. Popped out for supplies. I'll grab some food in case you want to eat. New socks and shorts are in the bathroom. All yours if they fit. Might be a good time to contact Jacob. His number is on the letter he sent. Be right back, Karen. Jeez. It only took Supermom eight years to give a shit. Dear Mrs. Diaz, my name is Jacob and I'm worried that with your son, son and Daniel, well, I, and, I, and I worked with your son, son and Daniel on a farm in California. There were some problems and Sean went missing. I am with Daniel now in Heaven Point, Nevada. He gave me this PO box address. So if you could, so if you get this, I think Daniel might be in danger. He needs help to get out of here. I can tell you more if you contact me at this number, 775-555-0118. Please hurry. Thank you, Jacob. This Sorry. place is quite remote. Good. At least nobody will be looking for me here. We checked everything in here. Phone. Shall I call Jacob? Time to hit up Jacob. Door. I'm not going out. Better wait for Karen in here. Uh, let's call Jacob. Hello? Jacob, it's me, Sean. Sean? No way! I've been waiting to hear from you for months! So you, you found my note in your sketchbook? <sighs> yeah. Sean. I know. I'm not far. In a motel. Good. Listen, I, I can't talk right now. I gotta go. Wait! Daniel, how's he doing? Meet me tomorrow afternoon on Brandy Highway. There's a, a, a junction just above Haven Point. There's a, a, a wild mice ranch billboard there. I'll be there at four. Jacob, wait! I can't talk, Sean. Be there tomorrow. Please. Damn, he couldn't really talk. All oh, this is so messed up. Wait for Karen. Okay, I'm going to stop here now. And I'll continue from here in the next video. Bye-bye.